I mean, the writing skills are, I think, of uh, essential importance for any of the physics, uh, physics majors here. Um, it doesn't do you much good if you do the science just for yourself. You want to tell people about it and you want to be able to do that in a, in a professional manner that uh, really gets the appropriate uh, appreciation for your scientific work. And uh, to do that, you need to understand. So what, are the, the, what is the really the form of communication that uh, scientists, physicists uh, use? And that is, uh, I think, one of the key elements in, in Junior Lab to really um, explain how this is done and then through practice really develop that skill. So um, two of the things that the students do in uh, 813 and 814, um, in addition to performing the experiments, is to a give 15-minute uh, presentations on the on the experiments in the style of an APS parallel session, and write uh, sort of four-page uh, papers on each experiment in the style of a physical review letter. And I think there are two um, elements onto this. I mean, one is, of course, that uh, this is a, a large part of their grade. So this is a, a skill that we, that we judge. But I think it is also a skill that the students really develop in uh, 813 and 814. Um, most of them, before joining the lab, have never written a paper. And uh, many, of them, uh, many of them have not given uh, presentations in that uh, style before. Some of them have, some of them have. And so this is a skill that they get to practice. It's a skill that uh, um, they really need later on. And it's also uh, something that many of them are rather worried about when, when starting the class. Uh, um, as uh, one of our teaching, in, uh, one of our writing instructors likes to say, uh, fear of uh, public speaking is uh, I mean, one of the top uh, fears that uh, people list when, when asked what they're what they really worried about. And, uh, what we tell the students and what they really find out during the class is that uh, public speaking is uh, a skill that you can really perfect through uh, practice. And for me as an instructor, and I hope also for the students, seeing the progression of them d uh, during the semester from really not knowing what to do with the 15 minutes of speaking time to having a professional uh, presentations at the very end uh, is really one of the most uh, gratifying things in uh, 813 and uh, then later in 814. To to see how much their skill really uh, improves over the course of uh, three, four months. So there, there are many ways in which we try to help the students really develop this communication skills. One is, uh, of course, uh, instruction and examples before they uh, uh, do their first presentation. Um, then uh, they give the presentation. They meet with uh, the writing instructors afterwards to uh, uh, go over the presentation and uh, get feedback from them. Typically, uh, what we do is we have 15-minute presentations and then a 15-minute question and answer session that we also use to give uh, feedback on the presentations. And then at the very end of the semester, the students take the, their favorite of the three presentations they gave during the semester, uh, refine it a bit, and then give it in front of um, uh, the whole class, uh, again, after getting feedback from the writing instructor. So there's a lot of... Uh, uh, practice and there's a lot of uh, back and forth between the students, the writing instructors and the lab staff. In 813, uh, obviously at the beginning of the semester, there's an extremely wide spectrum in terms of their communication skills. Some, some people are just naturally more um, inclined to, to talk to, uh, to a large audience to uh, sort of present themselves, whereas others are um, mortified uh, doing that. And I think by the end of uh, 813, that uh, spread becomes uh, much narrower. Um, of course, not everybody uh, will have the, the same uh, sort of spirit when, when giving a presentation. But uh, I think by the end of 813, everybody is at a level where they have no problem giving a 15-minute uh, professional uh, presentation. I think in 814, the, the focus really moves uh, from just being able to fill the 15 minutes uh, somehow to uh, a much more detailed discussion uh, of uh, sort of the, the professional elements of the of the presentations, the um, error, the uncertainty analysis, the the really the depth in which they examine the data that they've taken, and uh, the sophistication of the uh, analysis methods. I think that is more of the focus in in age 14. Uh, after age 13 has really prepared them to with sort of just the basic uh, tools.